An outbreak of wildfires has most of Oklahoma under a state of emergency tonight. High wind and severe drought are creating blowtorch conditions. At least one person has died. More than 200,000 acres have burned. 1,400 people have been forced from their homes. David Begno is there. Guys, we got another house in the path of the fire. In VC, Oklahoma tonight, wildfires are threatening the rural community of nearly 700 people, burning homes and killing cattle. They're shooting back into the wind. They can't reach the fire. In some places, the fire is spreading a mile every 8 to 12 hey, minutes. Come here. Come here. Get out of there. That wind changed. Since yesterday, more than 200,000 acres have burned across rural areas of western Oklahoma. All these power lines just saw three head of dead cattle. The largest fire burning is the Ray Fire in Dewey County. That fire is 28 miles long and 7 miles wide. There's a new tool Oklahoma firefighters have. It's called the GOES-16 satellite. It was launched last year. It's precise enough that forecasters at the National Weather Service are spotting small flames in rural areas before they are reported by people on the ground. It is a crucial tool that has alerted firefighters to 40 spot fires in the last 48 hours. There is a 61-year-old man who died because of these fires. I asked a fire official, what is it going to take in order to gain some containment on these blazes? And he said a change in weather. And tonight, Jeff, as the wind shifts, the weather's changing, but it's not for the better. Frightening conditions there. David Begno in Oklahoma, thank you very much.